going to be chatting to Amanda Ross, who will be riding Coco Popping Candy over at WEG. Yeah, to get to this point, we are pretty excited. Um, and uh, it will be her first flight, so you know, fingers crossed everything goes went to plan. And I'm sure it will. So, um, is she a good traveller? Do you think she'll handle the journey well? Usually is a really good traveller and like all performance horses, they've done quite a bit by road. Um, so hopefully between Rachel and I, um, we have enough experience and have tried to tick all the boxes so that we're kind of ready for anything. Fantastic. And tell me what your plans are once you arrive in the UK. Um, to have a really healthy horse and let her recover for the time that she needs to. So whether that's, you know, up to a week or whatever. Um, and then to um, see, be able to work out some plans for her um, in the lead up to our Australian camp. Um, and if we don't end up on a week team, then we have Blenheim CCI three stars to look forward to, which is the same weekend as we. Well. chat with Rachel Watts who is Shane Rose's groom. Hi Rachel, another adventure for Virgil. He must be racking up a few frequent flyer points now with Equine International Air Freight. Yeah, Virgil's travelled. This is now his third time travelling to the UK so he's definitely been there and done that and hopefully he's on his best behaviour for the flight. And he only competed a week ago. How is he? How well he's prepared for the journey? Yeah, he went to Camden a week ago and competed there and he went really well. He's um, had a little light week at home. Shane's been riding him, but just giving him a little freshen up for the flight. So he's been great, on good form and feeling really well. So he's where we want him to be for this flight. And we're certainly focusing on WEG at the moment, but do you know what the plans for Virgil are afterwards? Will he remain overseas or is he heading back here to Australia? I think the plan is to bring Verge home for sure. He's definitely one of Shane's favourites and Shane loves having him on the property. So I think we'll be endeavouring to get him home straight after WEG. It's another huge thrill to represent Australia again with this horse and compete at the highest level. Shane's already headed off and you'll be joining him shortly. He must be pretty excited. Yeah, Shane's super excited. He loves competing for his country and especially on the international scene. So it'd be great to catch up with Shane and hopefully he remembers to pick us up from the airport when we get there. <laughs>